And I'd meet people in the street and they'd say, oh, we saw your petition and we signed it, you know. <laughs> Yes, a friend of mine came around here one day up in arms because she'd just come out of one of the supermarkets and furious about the amount of plastic that was appearing on everything, especially small serves of things all wrapped up unnecessarily. And she wanted to do a petition locally, and I said, there's no point in doing it locally, it has to be a national petition, so we got on to change.org. Well, we got a few the first day, and then I was every time I looked, it seemed to have exploded. Like there was suddenly from a few hundred to a few thousand, and it, on it went. It was quite astonishing. Over 390,000, I believe. A West Australian woman has launched an online petition to stop supermarkets from doing it. She says it's unnecessary and causes pollution. And that's our daily dilemma today. Has supermarket packaging become excessive, James? It was fantastic. I was so grateful that other people did take it up because being in Broome, I couldn't go to the supermarkets physically down there, you know, go to the head office or anything. People are not blind, they can see the plastic lying around everywhere. Anyone who has looked at videos of Midway Island and those albatross chicks that are being fed plastic by their parents, you know, th those sorts of things are getting around. People are becoming more conscious. And also, they just don't like all that wrapping. You know, you get home and you've got all this unnecessary wrapping to get rid of. Coles and Woolworths have announced a series of initiatives to cut plastic waste and pollution. Environment groups have welcomed the move but say there is still a long way to go. The cool thing about this bag is that if, it is, uh, if, if it's damaged you can bring it into any one of our stores and we will replace it no questions asked and we will then recycle the old bag through our red cape uh, recycle uh, bins which will be in all of our stores by 30 June. The humble plastic straw, the latest target of our big supermarket chains race to be green. Seen as a growing threat to marine life, plastic straws will be taken off Woolworth's shelves by the end of the year. Woolies will also trial the removal of plastic packaging for 80 lines of fruit and vegetables. 